Ever wondered how to deal with an aggressive cat? Well, let's start at the beginning and try to understand what cat aggression looks like and why it might occur. Aggression in cats can manifest in a variety of ways. You might see your cat's body tense up, their ears flatten or their tail fluff out, they may hiss, growl, or even swipe with their claws. It's important to note that these are all natural behaviors for cats, but when they're directed towards humans or other pets, it becomes a problem. Now why does aggression occur? There are a few potential causes. One of the most common is fear. Yes, even the most aloof of cats can feel threatened or scared. This could be due to a sudden change in their environment, like a new pet or a person in the house, or it could be a reaction to a perceived threat, like a loud noise or a sudden movement. Another common cause of aggression is territorial disputes. Cats are naturally territorial creatures, and they may lash out if they feel their space is being invaded. This could occur if you introduce a new pet into the home, or even if you move furniture around and disrupt their familiar territory. Health issues can also lead to aggression in cats. Pain, discomfort, or underlying medical conditions can cause a cat to become irritable and lash out. If your cat's behavior changes suddenly, it's always a good idea to consult with a veterinarian to rule out any potential health problems. Understanding the cause of your cat's aggression is the first step to managing the behavior. It's not about punishing your cat or trying to suppress their natural instincts. Instead, it's about identifying the root cause of the behavior and addressing it in a way that respects your cat's needs and well-being. So, aggression in cats is not just about the cat being bad, it's about an underlying issue that needs to be addressed. Now how can you tell if a cat is being aggressive? Well let's dive right into the telltale signs. One of the most apparent indicators of aggression in cats is their vocal cues. This could be anything from a low growl, a hiss, or even an outright yowl. These sounds are not typical of a content cat and are a clear sign that something is amiss. However, it's not just about the sounds they make, it's also about their body language. For instance, an aggressive cat may show its teeth, a behavior that's more akin to wild animals than our domesticated friends. This is a cat's way of saying, back off, and is a warning that should not be taken lightly. Next on the list, we have swatting and biting. Now it's important to differentiate these behaviors from playful actions. Cats often play rough, swatting and biting in a friendly manner. However, when these actions are accompanied by the aforementioned growls, hisses, or tooth bearing, it's a safe bet that your cat is not in a playful mood. Now let's talk about body language. An aggressive cat might arch its back, puff up its fur, or whip its tail back and forth. These are all signs that your cat is on high alert and feeling threatened. It's also worth noting that a cat's eyes can say a lot. Dilated pupils, for example, often indicate fear or aggression. The key here is observation. Watch your cat's behavior closely. If you see a combination of these signs, it's possible that your cat is feeling aggressive. And remember, aggression doesn't always mean that your cat is bad or mean. Often, it's a response to a perceived threat, discomfort, or fear. Understanding these signs is crucial for maintaining a harmonious relationship with your feline friend. It allows you to respond appropriately, whether that's giving them space, calming them down, or seeking professional help. Remember, these signs are your cat's way of communicating discomfort or fear, so don't ignore them. By understanding and respecting their signals, you can ensure a happy and stress-free environment for both you and your cat. So, what do you do when a cat is displaying aggression right at this moment? It's a question that can leave even the most seasoned cat owners feeling a bit rattled. But fear not, there are steps you can take to manage this situation effectively. First and foremost, take a step back. This isn't about retreating in fear but giving the cat space to calm down. Remember, aggression is often a fear response. By stepping back, you're showing the cat that you're not a threat. It's a simple act, but it can make a world of difference in de-escalating a tense situation. Secondly, avoid making direct eye contact with the cat. In the feline world, direct eye contact can be seen as a challenge or a threat. It's a primal instinct that can trigger an aggressive response. Instead, try looking at the cat indirectly, or blink slowly. This slow blink is often regarded as a cat kiss, and can help to diffuse tension. Now this next tip might seem somewhat counterintuitive, especially if you're used to comforting a scared child or a nervous dog, but when a cat is showing aggression, it's crucial not to try and touch or calm it physically. Cats are highly independent creatures, and when they're scared or agitated, physical contact can cause them to lash out, 
Instead, speak in a soft, soothing voice and give them time to calm down on their own. Keep in mind that these are just immediate responses. They're not meant to solve the root cause of the aggression but to manage the situation at hand. And while these tips can be helpful, remember that every cat is unique and what works for one might not work for another. In the end, it's about understanding and respect. Understanding that aggression is often a sign of fear or discomfort and respecting the cat's space and individual needs, because at the end of the day it's not about winning or dominating but about fostering a relationship built on mutual respect and trust. Safety is the primary concern here both for you and the cat. So keep these tips in mind the next time you find yourself face to face with an agitated feline. You'll be better equipped to handle the situation and more importantly, to keep both of you safe. But what about the long term? How can you prevent your cat from becoming aggressive in the future? Well, let's delve into some long-term strategies that can help you manage your feline friend's aggression. One of the most effective ways to manage aggression is by providing a safe space for your cat. Cats are territorial creatures, and having a space they can call their own can greatly reduce stress and, consequently, aggressive behavior. This could be a specific room, a cozy corner, or even a cat tree. It's a place where they can retreat, relax, and feel secure. Next, regular playtime is essential. Cats are natural hunters, and playtime allows them to channel their hunting instincts in a healthy way. Use toys that mimic prey like feathers or laser pointers and remember to let your cat catch their prey now and then to avoid frustration. Aim for at least two 15-minute play sessions a day. Positive reinforcement is another powerful tool. Reward non-aggressive behavior with treats, praise, or extra cuddle time. For instance, if your cat sits calmly while you're brushing them, reward them with a treat. This way they'll associate being calm and non-aggressive with positive outcomes. Regular vet checkups are critical too. Sometimes aggression can stem from an underlying health issue that's causing your cat discomfort or pain, like arthritis or dental disease. Regular checkups can catch these issues early, allowing you to address them before they lead to aggression. Remember, every cat is unique, and what works for one might not work for another. It may take some time to find the right combination of strategies for your cat, but a calmer, happier cat is well worth the effort. So, we've covered safe spaces, regular playtime, positive reinforcement, and regular vet checkups. These are just a few of the many strategies you can employ to manage cat aggression over the long term. Remember, consistency and patience are key in managing and preventing cat aggression. But what if these strategies aren't working? When should you seek professional help? This is a question that may arise if you've tried everything you can, but your feline friend is still showing signs of aggression. You see, sometimes, despite our best efforts, our cats may continue to display aggression. This can be due to a variety of reasons, such as underlying medical issues, the presence of other animals, or even changes in the environment. It can be frustrating and even disheartening to see our beloved pets in such a state, but it's important to remember that help is available. If your cat's aggressive behavior persists, despite your attempts to manage it, then it might be time to consult a professional. This could be a veterinarian who specializes in feline behavior or a certified cat behaviorist. These professionals have the training and expertise to help identify the root cause of your cat's aggression and suggest tailored strategies to manage it. For instance, your vet might recommend a comprehensive medical checkup to rule out any underlying health conditions that could be triggering the aggression. Issues like hyperthyroidism, arthritis or even dental problems can cause discomfort and result in aggressive behavior. In some cases, medication might be necessary. Certain drugs can help to manage anxiety, fear, or territorial behavior in cats. These medications are not a quick fix but rather a part of a more comprehensive behavior modification plan. A cat behaviorist on the other hand, can provide more specialized behavior modification strategies. They can help you understand your cat's unique needs and behaviors, providing insight into why your cat might be acting out, and offering practical solutions to manage the aggression. It's essential to remember that seeking professional help is not a sign of failure. On the contrary, it's a testament to your commitment to ensuring your cat's well-being. Remember, every cat deserves a chance to feel safe and happy in their home. Don't hesitate to seek professional help if you're struggling with your cat's aggression. After all, your cat's happiness is our ultimate goal.